We won't do that. Um, and then you want to, the main thing is getting it in the corner. So then you kind of poke the corners. Go ahead and, and then start at one end and only go like one direction. Because see like over there, they skipped a brick. Um, and so if you want to consolidate and you want to maximize all your space, yeah. work from one end and go, you know, go to the other. So then you want to poke the corners really good. Like sometimes people do this and it kind of gets, you know, and then that's it. And then it's, there's a tendency to tilt for it to pillow either this way or go depressed. And so we just want to be aware of getting it fairly even. The main thing, again, these are handmade, so you're going to have inconsistencies. It's okay. The mortar is going to be on the top of these so that it's going to fill in any divot. Uh, but to have, so you have five forms, just make sure all of them are the same dimension. Mm -hmm. Because it would be horrible to try to build a wall with like, some of the bricks are this size, some of the right yeah. <laughs> yeah. So as long as your, your, bricks, your brick forms are the same, you're fine, and all the other un, the little idiosyncrasies are, uh, other than that, don't worry about it. And this is just like one by the wrapped in metal? <laughs> Yeah, one by. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, there is metal there, huh? Yeah, this is wrapped in metal. The other one, I think the other one is only partially wrapped in metal. So that's kind of like an innovation that I did when we did our brickyard. So let's just.